All right. I've got an idea for a little, uh, a little project. I was working on my K-Pro computer, and I found myself wanting to have a source of RS-232 data. And yeah, I could have got out my laptop and get an adapter and do that all kind of that, stuff, so that sort of thing. But I thought, wouldn't it be cool to have a little dongle, maybe a little 9-volt battery dongle that I can plug onto a serial port and see if it's working? I thought that'd be a really, really useful tool. And I haven't ever seen one before. So here we go. Let's try it out. So I'm going to use my favorite part. I'm going to be using the uh, ATtiny 3224. It's a real powerful little chip. And uh, I will put in a Max 232 chip to actually have real RS-232 values, uh, make it more compatible, and um, a connector. So... Uh, that will send everything out. And then I want to have a display. And I know I need to have a better, uh, a better uh, footprint, or not footprint, but symbol for this. But this is my OLED display right here. <laughs> it's just four pins, my OLED display. But let's take a look at the layout. I think that'll make it better. So you can see here, I'm going to have, uh, I'm going to have a nine pin connector on the edge here. I'm going to have a little strapper area uh, jumper area where I can uh, swap pins two and three. So you have a two, three or three, two, and you put your jumpers on here. Uh, here's a connector for a power input, nine volts in. I have a voltage regulator, which is right here. So I'm going to regulate the nine volts down to five volts. And then the uh, display will set on top of the circuit. So this is the uh, micro, U1 is the microprocessor and U2 is the Max 232 chip. And then I'll put some, I'll put some switches on it so you can have a menu system. Uh, I thought maybe you could pick which baud rate you wanna do or what, what kind of test you wanna do, have different tests built in. Uh, let's see here, 3D viewer. Uh, yeah, here we go. So it'll have, it'll have this connector on it and uh, it'll look something like that. And then you can see the outline here where the uh, I squared C uh, display will be on top of all of this stuff, right? So put it underneath all this stuff. So I think this would be a cool little project. So what do you think? Oh, wait a minute. And we got MSI dog on the back and the MSI computer. It's a lovely, lovely, lovely computer. So anyway, yeah, let's send it out.